Hello viewers, I'm SP and welcome back to Patrick's Parabox where I did it, I figured it out, I think. I, I'm i a little embarrassed, I'm a little embarrassed because it was so close to the thing that I was doing before. Uh, and then I basically, I had a very busy week and my uh, medical condition worsened, which is fun. And so this is the first time since the last recording that I have sat down to really look at it. And it took like three minutes of playing with it and I was like, oh right, I was right on the edge. I was just overcomplicating it in my head because I realized, oh, this one doesn't have eyes and we can't possess it, but that doesn't actually change anything meaningful about the loop. So, let's work this out. First things first. Uh, we need to get... I think it's pretty important that we get the one up there, so let's be the one and here. We'll put the zero under the two right here. Okay. So, if we do this, uh, and then we get this one up there, and it doesn't really matter, I think, what order the blocks on the bottom are in. It's like the most important thing is that the two blocks that should go up first are the zero and the one, so that we can still use the two as an emitter for the moment to emit our consciousness up the chain into another controllable block. Uh, and then... We need to have the four and the three still down here. Yeah, 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 like this. We need to be the two. Right, and it's okay for the three not to be possessible. This is... This is right, right? This is the thing I just did, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> you can tell it's been, uh, it's been a couple of... It's been a week. It's been a week for me. Uh, okay. Uh, we don't have to go to any fancy, any kind of fanciness to, I don't know, I was very convinced that I was going to have to do something fancy to get the three, uh, the, the triple infinity block to emit up to here so that we could use this as the exit um, to, to actually leave into the space next to the solution. But like, but like, why though? There's nothing, there's nothing meaningfully different about these two spaces. We can just jam the three into there. And then now when I press up, all five of our levels of infinity are pressed against the top here, so we should emit from the five of infinity block. That wasn't so hard, right? That's that's how that goes. I'm sorry it took me so long to get here, but hey, look at this. And... That's... Uh, is that it? <laughs> I don't know. I was expecting more fanfare. I did get an achievement. This is, this is a... <laughs> now we are smiley. Congratulations. Thank you for... Oh, okay. We did it. This video, this video is three minutes long. Okay. <laughs> well, this is exactly what I was afraid of. But yeah, I think that's, that's well and truly it then. So, Okay. I did it. I really, it, it has been weighing on my mind. This is silly to say because I have had like somewhat more serious stuff going on this week, but this has been in the back of my head the entire time. Like there's that one puzzle left. You got to finish that one puzzle. The thing is almost done. And the thing is almost done is one of my least favorite feelings in the world. Like let's just, let's just put the cap on it. Right? So eventually, eventually that's what happened. Thank you all so much for watching. I had a blast playing Patrick's Parabox for all of you. I hope y'all enjoyed it as well. When you come back next time, there's going to be new stuff. This, you know, new stuff is starting on the channel all the time. I don't even know what exactly yet. I have been thinking about... I hesitate to say this, because then if I change my mind, people are going to be disappointing or disappointed. But I, I've been thinking about doing some retro game stuff on the channel this summer, and I think that some of that may be starting up real soon. So come back for that. And of course, all the strategy and puzzle nonsense that you have come to love and we'll see you then